Who's heard of the bliss point? <laughs> okay, so the bliss point is the optimal ratio of sugar, fat, and salt that stimulates the reward center in the brain. There are scientists that work for big food companies and it is their full-time job to for make formulations to constantly find the optimal bliss point for their foods because this bliss point will activate a reward center so then we keep craving more and more so that we keep buying more and more of their product. And so this feature is called hyperpalatability. Palatability means like the taste, the, it's not only the taste, but the texture, the aroma, the whole experience. But this hyperpalatability hyper is the triggering of pleasure centers in the brain that cause us to crave more. And so hunger hormones are affected, causing you to eat more. Who's heard of hunger hormones? Does anyone know what that is? Okay. So hunger hormones, there's, there's multiple of them, but two in particular are leptin and ghrelin. Has anyone heard of leptin and ghrelin? Okay. So leptin is a hormone that's produced in our fat cells. And when it's produced, it tells our brain, we've had enough to eat. We have enough fat stored. We can stop eating. There's certain things that can affect leptin. Too much insulin can actually cause lept, uh, le our body to stop responding to leptin. So when we have insulin spikes all the time, and I'm going to talk about insulin spikes, when we eat a lot of sugar and that insulin rises a lot during the day, eventually our body can stop being responsive to leptin. And so even though our fat cells are telling our brain, hey, stop eating, our brain doesn't get the message. And we're constantly hungry. And then the other hormone is called ghrelin, and that's produced by the stomach. And that tells your brain, hey, I'm hungry, I need to eat. And typically when we eat, it stops being produced, and then we don't feel hungry anymore. But these hyperpalatable foods prevent that ghrelin from stop being produced. So like we keep, keep producing this ghrelin. When this optimal ratio of sugar, fat, and salt is triggered, and so we keep eating and eating and eating. And so Lay's potato chips, mm -hmm. bet, you just, bet you can't eat just one. Mm -hmm. They're right. And they know that. And they knew that when they came up with that phrase. Because it's true. Because they have a very hyperpalatable food product.